Hello, RPG Dawn here. Welcome back to another episode of our custom class series. Today's custom class will be the ninja. First, we're going to make a new state for the ninja. We go to our database cogwheel, states, make a new state, call it shadow state, auto removal timing turn end, duration 1 out of 2, then double click a row, parameter, ex parameter, evasion rate, and set that to 25%. We'll click OK, Apply, and now head over to our skills. We'll make sure we have enough spaces for our new skills and start on our level 1. A level 1 skill will be called Shadow Forces. It is a single attack skill that increases evasion for one or two turns. We'll double click the effects, State, Add State, and add in our new state, Shadow State. We will make our new skill type, Ninja Art, by going to Types, Skill Types, and putting Ninja Art. We'll also go ahead and add two new weapon types, Ninja Tools and Ninja Scrolls. Back to our skills and back to Shadow Forces. Skill type Ninja Art, MP cost 5, Occasion Battle Screen, Scope 1 Enemy, a Message, No Weapon, HP Damage, our Regular Attack Formula, Regular Variants and Critical Hits. On to our next skill, Shuriken Throw. You will first need to make three new items. We'll go to our Items tab. Make Shuriken, Kunai, and Fuma Shuriken. Set each one of them to not consumable, then go back to your skills. You will need Yanfly's Skill Core Engine and their Skill Item Cost plugin. I'll leave a link to both of those plugins in the description. Once you have those plugins, go back to your items. Make sure you know where your Shuriken, Kunai, and Fuma Shuriken are. My Shuriken is number 18, so I will go back to skills and use this nut tag. Replace the 18 with the number of the row that your item is in. Replace the 1 with how many of that item you want to be used every time the skill is used. Since we are using shurikens, there will be no cost. Skill type Ninja Art, Scope 1 Enemy, Occasion Battle Screen, A Message, Weapon Ninja Tools, HP Damage, Our Formula, Critical Hits, and Regular Variants. Our level 2 skill for our other build is Jutsu of Water. This is a single target attack with a water-based element. Skill type Ninja Art, MP cost 10, scope 1 enemy, message, ninja scrolls for a weapon, HP damage, our formula, element water, critical hits, and our regular variants. Once all that is done, we can go to our level 3 skill, kunai throw. This skill throws a kunai at a single enemy. Instead of using 18 for the note, we'll use 19 since our kunai is in the 19th spot. Skill type ninja art, scope 1 enemy, no cost, occasion battle screen, message, weapons and ninja tools, HP damage, and this formula. Yes to critical hits and regular variants. We can now go to our Jutsu of Earth, which is the same as Jutsu of Water, but with an Earth element. Our next skill for our Shuriken build is Fuma Shuriken. This throws a Fuma Shuriken at an enemy, so our note will be a 20 instead of a 19. This is also the strongest of the Shuriken attacks. Jutsu of Fire is the same as Jutsu of Earth, but with a Fire element. Both of our builds have a level 5 skill. Storm of Ninja Tools uses each of our tags because you need a shuriken, a fuma shuriken, and a kunai to use it. You also need ADTP to use this skill. Our level 5 skill for our jutsu build is called Tri Dragon Jutsu. This is a skill that hits every enemy with whatever element they are weakest to. We pull this off by going to our types, making a new element called All, and then under every enemy, we go to Traits, double click a row, Rate, Element rate, go to our new all, and change our 100% to 200%. We click OK and apply. Back to our skill. We give our description, skill type ninja art, scope all enemies, MP cost 30, battle screen, message, ninja skulls for a weapon type, HP damage, the same formula as our other jutsus, but with a 5 instead of a 3. Yes to critical hits and our variants. We'll click apply once all that's ready, then head over to our classes. We will make our ninja, make sure, make sure the equipped weapons are ninja tools and ninja scrolls, make sure its skill type is ninja art, and add every skill at the appropriate level. Lastly, we'll go to our weapons and make our new weapons. Ninja tool with the weapon type ninja tool and ninja scroll with the weapon type ninja scroll. We'll click apply when ready and click OK. In battle, we see our ninja art keyword, all our skills, and notice that to the right of your skills, it tells you 
how many ammunition you need for that skill. If you're able to use it, it will be in white text, but if you can't use it, it will be see-through. We can't use kunai though because we don't have a kunai. With all that done, you have your ninja. That's it for this custom class. Support us at Patreon by clicking the annotation. Any amount helps and allows me to dedicate more time to making tutorials and answering questions. Please like and subscribe to show your support. If you have any ideas of a custom class I should make, please leave a comment about it. Thank you for watching. See you on the next video.